Hello friends, I am back. Welcome to Abra Knowledge Channel. Let's go to the storytelling series number 26. The story let your light shine. All stories from this same book called Arabic Stories for Language Learners. I have chosen three short and sweet stories from that book. Number one, The Lost Treasure. Number two, The Thief Who Was Robbed. And number three, the caliph and the milk seller. Let's go to the story number one. The lost treasure. It is said that the man had seven children and he wanted to ensure their income after he died. When his moment of death grew closer, he gathered his children and said to them, I have left you in the land that I own an expensive treasure. I hid it there. Go and get it out after my death so you can make a living out of it. When the father died, his children began to dig up the land inch by inch, but they could not find the treasure and their efforts were in vain. Then they looked and saw the land was flooded, that is, whole land is drained. So they agreed to grow wheat there and they did it. The land yielded a deal of wheat, great deal of wheat. They, are, they ate some and sold the rest and lived a comfortable life. Then they understood that the land was the treasure their father had told about there. So the moral of the story is always make use of the opportunity whatever you get. So let's go to the story number two. The thief who was robbed. The story goes like this. Two thieves stole your donkey and one of them took it to the cell in the market. On the road, he encountered a man carrying a bowl with fish in it. And the man said to him, Is this donkey for sale? The thief answered, Yes. The man said, Hold this dish so I may try it out. He rode the donkey and when he was distance away from the thief, he entered one of the alleys, disappeared and made off with the donkeys. The thief knew that he had been deceived. That means he had been cheated. So he returned to his partner with the plate of fish. His partner asked, did you sell the donkey? He said, yes. The partner asked for how much and the thief said for the same amount for it, but for the same amount that you paid for it and this bowl is the profit. So the moral of this story is always be honest and true to your heart. So guys, 
let's go to the story number three. The Caliph and the Milk Seller. The story goes like this. The Caliph Umar bin Al Khattab. May God be pleased with him. Learned that old woman who was cheating when she sold milk. And he said to her, old woman, do not cheat the people and do not mix your milk with water. She who cheats us is not one of us. The old woman said, I hear and will obey, O leader of the believers. After some days, he passed by and said to her, Old woman, did I command you not to mix your milk with water? The old woman said, By God, I did not do that, O leader of believers. Then one of her daughters from inside the tent said, O oh mother, are you cheating the people? Lying to the caliph and breaking the, your oath. Uh, Umar heard her and he liked her words and candor in what is right and chose her as a wife for his son. Here, the moral of the story is, don't, do not tell lie, always be honest, true to your heart. Let's go to reflection. Read books, tell stories to your children, enjoy your life. So guys, that's all for today. See you next time. Till then, take care. Have a nice day ahead. Bye-bye.